The following announcement has been paid for by the New World Order. You know who I am, but you don't know why I'm here. What's going on here? Takes it awaits. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Heavy Machinery from Superior, Wisconsin. Weighing in at 330 pounds, Otis! You know, I tried having a conversation with this guy earlier, but I don't speak meathead. Oh, don't worry, Corey, I can teach you. Things just became absolutely glorious. Can I get a hallelujah? Hallelujah! Not from you, Byron. How many times do we have to go through this? I've been practicing all week. You haven't gotten any better. And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 235 pounds. The Former United States champion. He's held titles all over the world, but Rude said, nothing I have ever accomplished will hold a candle to what I do in WWE. You look at a guy who's got tremendous work ethic. He's always the first guy at the arena, last guy to leave. Spends tremendous amount of time working on his physique, working on his in-ring ability, and you see the results each and every week. how to make an entrance and he's got a true veteran of the squared circle Robert Roode is a master of forcing his opponents to wrestle his slower paced more methodical style of match and then there's Otis who ate paint chips as a kid Oh, brutal. And the referee starts his 10 count. Larry. with a belly to belly. Big back body drop. Lost in the corner right now. Splash! What impact. Check out Brood's offense. Otis got out of there in time. Launched with a belly to belly. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Part of what's so glorious about Robert Roode is his old school style. No bells, no whistles, just straight up in your face wrestling. Yes, but that lack of flash can make for a bit of a predictable game plan. His opponent could have possibly scouted him before and coming into this match knowing what to expect of Robert Roode could easily make things tough for Roode. Oh, and then it's Brew with the offense. Lightning fast reflexes. Oh. 
Great counter. Impressive in-ring IQ on display. My gosh. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him up. And oh! He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Yeah, he needs to make an adjustment here. Just carrying the opposition here. Scoop slam! I like it. That's what he does. Keep on the attack. Oh, right up there. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Check out Brood's offense. Oh, what a forearm. This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages and in over 110 countries. Oh, what a right. Man, that's some attitude behind it. Launched with a belly to belly. Trying to sneak one. Uh-oh. Look at Otis. Good night. That's his go-to move. Can he finish for the victory here? And Otis picks up the win. Enormous victory right there. I grew lost. What was I getting all those hallelujahs for? Practice? Folks, we just saw one of the most exciting matches you'll see anywhere. This just became the KO Show. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Marieville, Quebec, Canada. Weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens used to fight for himself and his family. Now he fights against authority and everything Shane McMahon stands for. A universal champion, a United States champion, the list goes on and on, and Kevin Owens owes it all to himself. Here come the eight reach. Some call him the pride of Spider. Some call him the pride of Quebec, Canada. But he doesn't care what you call him as long as you end with Sir. Here's Kevin Owens. And then there's the premier athlete, Tony Nese. 
who has really come into his own lately, has become more confident in himself, and that confidence has paid dividends in the ring. Yeah, I didn't know it was even possible for Nice to become more confident in himself, but he proved that it was, and you're right, it's only made him better. Kevin Owens just too fast for him. Surprisingly quick. Down in a hurry. For the first time tonight, Kevin Owens looking to it. Oh, look out. What a flip. A second time, Kevin Owens is. Look out. And his knees showing some agility. Guys, I see Kevin Owens as that person at the office who does half the work but still gets promoted. He's the bully at school nobody likes who still gets the gold star. Everybody's got a Kevin Owens in their life. It's just unfortunate for the WWE Universe that the Kevin Owens in their lives is Kevin Owens. Unfortunately, Byron, life's not fair, and it's not Kevin Owens' fault you never deserved a gold star. Kevin Owens sure brings an attitude with him to the ring. I'm not sure any superstar can match him for pure bravado. You're not wrong, Saxton, but that attitude's earned. Owens, look at this. Frog splash! And into a quick cover is Kevin Owens. And he gets the shoulder up. Might have slipped there, Cole. Pick it up on your analogy about Kevin Owens, Byron. The WWE Universe has had to endure so many tangents from Owens and countless disruptions to WWE programming because Owens finds the need to act like a petulant child. You guys give me all the way from the... And his knees showing some agility. Say, fight Owens, fight. It might only be academic at this point for Kevin Owens, who is teeing away at will. Throwing it to the crowd as the referee's count continues. Six. And he's heading back in. Uh-oh. Stun, Owens, stun. That might just do it. There it is. Now the question is, can Kevin Owens finish? I don't know if you guys know this or not, but premier athletes, they don't stay grounded for long. Oh, thanks for the factoid. Definitely not where you want to be right now. And here we go again. Kevin Owens planning it. Here we go. And he misses the mark. Talk about a rough landing. entertaining when Kevin Owens starts his antics. Oh, and a wicked clothesline! Shoulders down, is it enough? Mace gets the shoulder up! Way too early. Kevin Owens doing a roll-up! He's going for the pin. Gets the shoulder up. Yeah, it's going to take more than that to keep him down. Oh, it's able to counter. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Finds a way to reverse. And another reversal. Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. Oh, knee right to the spine. Oh, no. oh, a knee. Lights out. These competitors have been unloading on each other since the bell. Just looking for that window of opportunity. And now might be the time to seize the moment. Now's the time to keep the pressure on him. Here we go. Kevin Owens is setting it up. Uh-oh. Stun, Owens, stun. So glad I bet on him to win. Oh, man. Nice is in some serious... What a win for Kevin Owens. Here is your winner, Kevin. Oh! 
An entertaining display tonight for Owens. I think Tony Nese got too distracted in counting his abs. He does have a lot of them. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win here tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Anarchist from New York, weighing in at 235 pounds, Nightmare. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. I have to say, the level of pride he has in his game is truly impressive, guys. Yeah, he's about as proud as a peacock, Michael. And you know what? He has every right to be. comes the monster among men and his opponent weighing in at 385 pounds Braun Strowman Strowman's an absolute force of nature terrifyingly powerful Yeah, you start to feel like there's nothing Braun Strowman can't do. Well, there is one thing we know for a fact Braun Strowman can't do, and that is be stopped. The monster among men is unbelievable. The monster among men, Braun Strowman, is equal parts power and fury. Possibly the most destructive force ever in WWE history. 
And looking around this Saginaw Arena, there doesn't appear to be one person in their seat. This is a big risk. Will it pay off? From the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, a piercing elbow. Guys, just look at Braun Strowman. Where do you even begin with your strategy against the monster among men? Two words, Cole. Run and hide. If that fails, you need to evade and strike when you get the chance because you do not want to get caught by those hands. We often talk about worst-case scenarios when it comes to Braun Strowman. Every scenario is worst case. Oh, what impact. He's stalking his opponent from the top turn. Look at this. Imploding 450 splash. In a bad way here, guys. Saw that one coming. Oh, breakneck speed. What a hurricanrana. Boom, what impact. Chop combination. Across the forehead. And he's just dominating at this point. Just producing an onslaught. Neckbreaker. Putting it all on the line. Well, uh, what? What? No! Imploding 450. He could do it here. Ron Strowman with an easy kick out there. And we continue. Uh oh, he's in trouble here. Boom! Right to the jaw. Oh, oh you could pick up your teeth in section 112. He's not going to like this. What a barreling spear. He goes for the cover. And the shoulder's up in time. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. We have seen such a physical match from these combatants, and the wear and tear is starting to show. And now's the time where the smartest competitor needs to take advantage of the situation. He needs to figure out the quickest way to end this. Oh, man. This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages and in over 110 countries. Standing Spanish flyer, are you? Oh, come on, ref. Yeah, you can't let him get away with that. Not in a match this big. Braun Strowman kicks out easily. Not yet. Scouted. Dominating cross body. Ron Strowman is going to have to revise his game plan because right now, the one he's using ain't working. He was the favorite for this match, but that's changing rapidly. Monsters don't impart much fear when they're in this position. Lightning fast reflexes. Oh, to the back of the neck. Point. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Oh, my. Gets him with a counter. Cross body. Here it comes. He's got him. What a barreling spear. Here's the cover for the win! One, two, and he got a near fall out of it. Yeah, even now, Strowman has the strength and will to power out. Ouch. Elbow drop! He's certainly looking in command at the moment. It's starting to come together in a big way for this guy. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Well, uh, what? What? No! Imploding 450! He can end it here! 
Near fall after near fall in this matchup here. Incredible, absolutely incredible. And he misses the mark. Talk about a rough landing. Oh, right off the turnbuckle. Face first. Evading possible disaster there. Neck breaker. Back now inside the ring. Looking for the finish. He's in trouble. What a barreling spear. He's got the shoulders down. And this match is over. Here is your winner, Nightmare. That's a big win right there. Wow. We just saw a monster slayer strike right before our very eyes. And that'll do it here for this one-on-one -on -one match. I hope you enjoyed it as much as this live crowd appears to have enjoyed it. Quiet on the set. Can we please have quiet on the set?